Yo what's going on guys, today I'm go I am going to be showing you how to change your dedicated video memory on your laptop or desktop. So I made a video about this uh, maybe one year ago on my Windows 7 operating system but this is an updated video of what I did. So I'm using Windows 10 operating system now and I'm going to I'm going to be showing you how to change the dedicated video memory. So basically on my uh, laptop I have is installed 4 gigs of RAM. So let me show you what, which is the recommended video memory for your uh, for the amount of RAM installed on your PC. If you have 2 gigabytes of RAM, you'll need to have 256 me megabytes dedicated on your uh, PC. If you have 4 gigs, 5,012 megabytes, and uh, if you have 8 gigs or more, you will need to have 1,024 megabytes installed dedicated on your PC. So, yeah, let me show you how much uh, dedicated memory is on my laptop right now. So there we have it. I'm using Intel HD graphics, which sucks because it takes um, it, it doesn't own its own memory. It takes uh, it takes a small part from the RAM. So yeah, so my dedicated video memory is 32 megabyte, and I need to change it to 5,012 megabyte because I have 4 gigs of, of RAM installed on, on my PC. So let's go ahead and do this. To do this, I'm going to access the BIOS. So let's go. Alright guys, I'm going to access the BIOS of my PC. So I press the power button and press F to repeat the As you can see, the BIOS turned on, on, turned on right now. But uh, to access the BIOS of your PC, you need to rapidly press F2, F10 or delete and see which one of them works for your PC. So there is my BIOS and uh, as you can see, there are some tabs listed which is main tab advanced tab boot tab security save and exit so in this case to um, uh, to access the graphics configuration i will need to go to the advanced tab and scroll all the way down until i find graphics configuration pressing it and you can see the uh, dvmt pre-allocated is 64 but we need to change it to the to the last to the max uh, amount of megabytes listed on the pre-allocated memory uh, and uh, mine is 512 megabytes the maximum they're gonna have a press enter and now I'm gonna press um, I'm gonna press to save and exit to, to save it on my PC so let's go and press yes now let's go and uh, save it if you change or not all right guys here I am back again now let's see if it if it worked or not so let's go to the display settings scroll down advanced display settings display, settings, display data properties so there you have it guys 512 megabytes dedicated with the memory changed from 32 to 512 megabytes. So what happened actually? Uh, the Intel graphics, Intel Edge graphics, took about a half a gigs for my RAM. As you can see, there there is only 3.45 uh, gigabyte usable, and it goes to the ded dedicated video memory. But keep in mind that this works only for um, those users who have who use Intel Edge graphics, like I do. So, if you don't see the option for graphics configuration in your BIOS, then you need to uh, contact your lap laptop manufacturer to get some help from them or, uh, or try to update your BIOS. So, that's all I can say. So, thanks you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you, if you find this tutorial helpful, just be sure to give me a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next time. Peace out.